All right, we're talking 1998 Ford Ranger. Passenger side, wheel arch repair. It's welding time, or as Lisa, I like to say, spot welding time. I'll do my attempts at some welding today. And uh, as you could say from the previous videos, I've metal fabricated this patch. And I've uh, done all I can do to get to this point. Now is the time for trying. Or as uh, Yoda would say, do, I do not. There is no do. Uh, I squished it up a little bit. All right, let me grab my tool. <laughs> What being been doing much talking here? I'm just trying to get some stuff done. I'm using a titanium 125 Easy Flux. Uh, what was I saying? Titanium Easy 5, 125 Easy Flux, Flux 4 Welder. Alright, this is what I'm using today. And I'm trying to get this, get that heat up. Alright, now I'm, I'm going to put the voltage on H, wire speed on 7, or on 6. Voltage on G to try to dial this in. <sighs> yep. Ugh. Once I get going, I'll get going. That's all right. What I have learned is the tighter the no less gap, better result. I leave the tip about halfway sticking out. And I work around the panel. Sometimes the tips are obviously a little bit more than that. Yeah. A little slow going today, folks. A little slow going. The slow is fast. Slow is smooth and slow is fast. What is the old saying? Slow is smooth, and smooth is fast. That's my attempts when I do things now. I'm not trying to be a speed demon. Not at all, not at all. I'm just gonna let this video run. So oh, I run out of memory. <laughs> yep. I'm just gonna let it ride. And I'm gonna fly. <laughs> or I run out of daylight, one or the other. I'm using Vulcan Vulcan E711 something wire. Uh, 0 .030 uh, is the wire that I'm that I'm using. It's not the original wire that uh 
comes with comes with the machine um, I have to say this stuff is better and what I mean by that it it seems to penetrate better uh, oh yeah seems to penetrate better overall and um, and less waste and I use this called it my welding screwdriver welding flathead to press the panels together oh. sometimes I get I don't get trigger shy Dang, no. I don't get necessarily trigger shy but my left hand wants to wander and I'm actually ambidextrous for the most part So when I get to that like that, I, I'll clean it out and come on and move on to, some, move on to a different spot. Because I don't like to see all the weld up looking like boogers. I call them welding boogers. But I guess watching somebody weld might be like, might be like watching paint dry. If they're a really good welder, then it could probably be fun to watch. <laughs> I don't claim to be a good welder. <laughs> I just, uh, I do a lot of grinding. <laughs> I do a lot of grinding for the most part. To make those welds look better. something different I'm working around my camera messing with my settings and put it on E this time. I feel like I'm getting over penetration of the of the weld material or something. I, I'm just really trying to be conscious of what I'm doing right now. The material itself is only one sixteenth of an inch thick.
So with that said, one sixteenth of an inch thick is pretty, pretty darn thin, right? And the, the panel itself on the truck, <laughs> brand new. Hopefully like 18 gauge maybe. I don't know, I'm just guessing. I'm just working in inches. <sighs> Not much going on, folks. Hopefully I'm still recording. <laughs> Might have to come back through and cut this down and then leaf cut it. We'll see. Should be interesting. <sighs> yeah, that tip's pretty long, ain't it? Try to count about 3,000 to 4,000. 1, 1,000, 2, 1,000, 3, 1,000. Seems to help. <clears throat> like I said, I'm not claiming. Look, just working around my camera. All right, I'll do a little bit more and we'll call this one a wrap. Let you guys get the hint though, right? Move on to a different section. Alrighty. So, we'll let this one be for a little bit. Ew, welding. At least attempting to weld. Anyway, I'll get it through. Practice makes perfect. And, uh,. It is what we got. I'm gonna let it cool off and clean it up a little bit. Alrighty, I'll see you on the next one.
And if you're still with me, you guys are true able crafters. <laughs>